honestly thought it was taken off then. Thanks for that, dude. You really needed to do that, didn't you? Hey guys, welcome back to another Airless PD5 video. Today we're going to be looking at this Chevy Caprice. This is a 2016 version. Uh, this is, I believe, a add-on, what I added into the game, not a replacement. So, um, pretty good there, so I don't have to worry about changing um, up my other vehicles. So, yeah, pretty good. Never really normally do a Caprice on this channel, but I thought, why not? Let's do one today. So we are doing a Caprice. Um, it is a uh, San Andreas State Trooper. I haven't done a Trooper Patrol for a little bit, so I'm going to do one of those as well. And yeah, so let's have a look at the interior on this vehicle. There we go. Looks pretty decent. Um, I don't really have a uh, Trooper outfit, so I'm just using a Highway Patrol. I know obviously that's not <laughs> the same, but that is the closest that I can possibly get to it um, without... Uh, adding all this other stuff in with EUP. I never have much luck changing EUP stuff, so that's why I never really do it. Uh, maybe I need to look, in, look into that more and see if I can change it. But anyway, that's not really what this episode is about. Uh, so we've got, looks like we've got a vest in there and a computer. There you go, you got the, the car freshener who actually made the vehicle. Link in the description down below if you want to use the vehicle pack yourself, like always. And yeah, there we go. So yeah, exterior, quite a nice livery. There we go. And uh, let's have a look at the light setup. Stage 1, you've got traffic advisor on the back. There we go. Nothing else. Stage 2 lighting, you've got some uh, red and blues on the back. And some side runners on the bottom there. Nothing, nothing in the front, which is a bit odd. But, uh, yeah, that's all good there. Stage 3 lighting. There we go. It's quite, light. It's quite a uh, Christmas tree, I think, today. Um, but, yeah, there we go. So like I said, I don't really normally do Caprices. They're not my favourite looking vehicles that the police use. But uh, like I said, we are change it up a little bit today. So let's get on patrol and see what we get into today. What's that down there? I can't see this. Do a U-turn. Let's see what that is down there. I thought there was a bike just randomly stopped in the middle of the road. Animal under dispatch. Can I get a, another unit down on Great Ocean Highway? Um, I've just got a abandoned vehicle in the road, a, a abandoned bike in the road. Just want to get another unit just for traffic control. Uh, I will go, go through that because it is pretty bad. Position. Um, let's see if they got any keys or anything on it. So we can move it. Oh, there we go. I forgot to say at the beginning of the video that I have actually changed um, changed out all my vehicles in game. So the police slots, the sheriff slots, the. Um, uh, what's that called? Ranger slot. Yeah, I changed quite a lot of them out. Uh, so there's no plate on this bike. So we can't check that. Maybe we can get a VIN off of it. Uh, what we should do really first is move it out of the way. See if I can, see if I can start it and move it out of the way. Oh, I can. Nice. They left the keys. How uh, how nice of them. I never ran over you. Let's just move the uh, bike out of the way. There we go. Then I can move my uh, Caprice and get the traffic back open. I just want to get another unit in so I don't get smacked by another car on the other side of the other, other lane there. There we go. Oops, wrong button. Right, let's go and have a look. Um, still haven't checked that, changed that um, texture popping over there. I just still haven't changed it in the sense. Need to do that. But let's see if we can get a. We have citizens reporting an attempted bank. Yeah, not for me at the moment. Thank you very much. Uh, can we get like a VIN check? I swear there was a button you can do that. Uh, request vehicle check. Roger, okay, we found a license plate on it. Target vehicle license plate. 74 John Victor Victor 283. Target is 104. Guess it was in the uh, little um, bucket thing. Okay, I can't remember what you call them. Where you can store your items in. A little storage compartment. Um, this is to see what's up with this. So there's any reason why the uh, bike is just randomly left there. It's all good there. Ah. Maybe when we was on the side of the road when I was doing my introduction, they saw, oh, please, so we, 
you just legged it. Seems a bit weird why you would just get off a bike and leg it, but you know, he's nowhere to be seen. Uh, but it does have a warrant out for him. He hasn't got his uh, bike anymore, so he can't use that. That's obviously going to get towed and back into the impound lot. And uh, yeah, he's got an arrest warrant for burglary. That would have been good if we actually stopped him. But yeah, um, so let's just tow that one off. Thanks, Ranger, for the uh, backup. You can free to go. Uh, let's tow this one out of here. Get that one off the road into the impound lot, and then hopefully, fingers crossed, when he comes in, picks up the vehicle. Um, when he comes in and picks the vehicle up, then uh, we might be able to catch him for a uh, arrest warrant. So that'd be good. Uh, where is the tow truck? Tow truck's over there. There we go. All done and dusted. And uh, Animal wanted to be back to and available for calls. Attention unit one, Adam one. We have a traffic alert for breaking and entering. Oh, maybe that might be the guy. Maybe that be the guy from what we was talking about. Oh, texture popping. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about that. Um, like I said, I need to try and fix that still. Oh my god, he's taken off. Attention unit um, one, Adam one. The one who's tailgating. Um, I believe it's this one in front of us. Let's see if we can get a plate check. Yep. Zero eight X ray union young Target two two four. Vehicle license plate. 08 X-ray Union Young 224 yep. a traffic violation a warrant issued proceed with caution see in real life I would probably um, call him back up now and get some backup behind me before I even pull over this individual but you know how at GTA is if you call him back up they're just gonna come in and just bugger off again so <laughs> you ass <laughs> um right let's light him up light this individual up. Where are you going? No, you don't. Get in. Get off to the um, hard shoulder. Or the emergency breakdown, I should say. Um, is he taking off? Let's stop the fucking car, asshole. I honestly thought he was taking off then. Thanks for that, dude. You really needed to do that, didn't you? Let's find a better location. A little bit further up the road. That'd be brilliant. Taking off. Ah! He's taken off. In, uh, and I want to dispatch. We're going to get in a 1080 with that um, suspect who is wanted. It's going to be Union Road in Blaine County in Grapeseed. It's going to be northwest bound at this moment in time. Uh, can I get additional units and possible air unit? As it is a wanted person, I want an air unit. Ooh, that sound of that car when it, it revved quite a bit then. Speeds around 70 miles per hour in a 35. Uh, traffic is light, no pedestrians. Risk is low at this moment in time. It's going to be great, uh, Grapeseed Main Street going uh, south eastbound. That texture popping could be actually the vehicles that I added in. I don't know yet. It's going to be CV Road. It's going to be going eastbound. It's going to be going southbound. Making a right hand turn onto uh, East Joshua Road. Going southwest. Speeds around 60 miles per hour, increasing to 70. Traffic is light, no pedestrians. Nice, we've got a sheriff unit with us. Uh, 
nice, nice, nice. Still East Joshua Road, southwest bound. Um, let's see if we can get an air unit just in case we do start to pit. And if he does flee, then we can, uh, on air unit, keep a track on him. We've got a license plate, so that's good. I will request a pit. See if we can get a pit. Nearly hit a golf cart. Uh, pit is clear. Nice. So we've got a pit. What we can do. That unit is a little far back. See if we can get another unit in. Oops, not a canine. It's going to be on Joshua Road, it's going to be southbound in uh, Grand Genora Desert and Blaine County. Still continuing. Traffic is light, speeds around 70 miles per hour. Coming out to an intersection, straight for a stop sign. Still on Sonora Road, going out of Blaine County now, going heading towards Los Santos. We do have clear to, clear to pit, so I will do a pit in a minute. So we do have a ramba, yes we do. <laughs> Don't really want to do a pit without a ramba. Might be our opportunity now on the straight bit in it in a little bit. Thought it was a straight part there, but it wasn't. Right, still on Sonora Road, going south eastbound, still heading towards Los Santos and Vinewood. Here we go, there's a straight part, what I was on about. Guys, oh, <laughs> I just looked behind then. Right, let's go for it now. Oh no! Maybe the rampart's non existent in this car. Oh. There it is! Perfect! Try and box him in. Spin him out! There it is. Pin him in! God, I swear to God. This is when 5M comes better. <laughs> Uh, attempted pit, pit successful, but still continuing. It's going to be Snora Road, still now Elgin Ave, southbound, just passing Vinewood. At least we've got a unit to keep uh, eyes on the unit, on the uh, suspect, I should say. So now we're on Clinton Ave, going northwest bound. Still continuing straight for a red light. Speeds around 70 to 80 miles per hour. Can't really do a pit at this speed through these residential areas. Well, oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Still on Clinton Ave, going southwest bound, straight through red lights. Took air nearly. Nearly lost control. Lascunas Boulevard. Can I get some PD units? Because you possibly might have lost all the PCSU units. <laughs> That's good as Boulevard still. Let's see if I can put. Oh my goody god. Oh, this doesn't have enough power. I need like a Tahoe or something. It's our PD units. I've added in. We've got every state, uh, well, every, um, a, uh, what's it called? Nope, gone completely gone out of my head. 
Come on, stop the miracle now. Oh. Let's see if we can do some spike strips. How did you place those two? Along the... What? What type of logic is that? Come on, dude. That was nearly it. I should have just carried on with that then. God damn it. Uh, Dorset Drive, I think that's Drive. West Eclipse Boulevard, northbound. Vehicle all over the road, got um, heavy damage to the vehicle. We started all the way at the top of the map, and now we're near to the bottom of the map. <laughs> got to level. West Eclipse Boulevard, going eastbound. Don't you. Let's see if we can go in for a pit again. Yep, cleared to go for a pit. Nice. Way. Stop going all over the road like that. I'm trying to get a pit on you, dude. You are a sneaky little bugger, you are. Yeah, good. Nice. Well done. No, I'm not going to do it on the um, Vinewood Boulevard. Jesus. Oh, she's 1050. Still continuing. Why have we got two units now on the, in the air? Two airs? Strange. Dispatch, we got the suspect in sight. We're on Mirror Park Boulevard. In Mirror Park now. God damn. I mean, he is wanted, so makes sense why he's fleeing like this. I shouldn't have done it that far out. Pit from the other side. Then you've got the curb stone there. God damn it. Come on. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh no. <laughs> so I'm, I want this to, I want a pit to work. <laughs> so badly. I'm trying to make this realistic as possible as well so not driving on the um, sidewalk or anything like that. I need to do pits at the right time. There we go. Box man, no! We're on all the units. Easily box them in then. Oh, no. Textures at all. Okay, I really need to fix that. <laughs> this is crazy pursuit, though. How we've pretty much just gone over the whole entire map. Ah! Alright, uh, you're done, dude. You're done. You're done. Oh, for an alley. Oh! I, I want this pit to work. Come on, go that way. Oh, I didn't have enough power to do that. Try and spin him out on the turn. There we go. Okay, now you paid me. Um, 
Oh. This is where we might have lost him. <laughs> How did they get up there? Oh. Oh, boy. Okay, we cut him off that way. We've got a lot of texture popping going on around here. No, I had it, I had it, I had the pit in progress. There we go. There we freaking go. Get your hands up, get your freaking hands up. Get out, get out your hands up. Stay away while do not move. Get down to the ground now, get down to the ground. Don't get in the vehicle, you stupid idiot. Hope you, what? Gonna let that officer do this thing. There we go. <laughs> and it'll be all good. Don't worry about it. Let's go around this way. Animal one to dispatch. We got one in custody. That was a long ass pursuit. You. Oops. Did not mean to do that. You. Are an idiot. Turn around. An idiot. Why are you doing that? Let's search the vehicle. Um, briefcase full of $100 bills, and uh, that's it. What did you find on her? Oh, more pain on the cell phone. This stupid texture popping, I swear to God. Um, right, let's get you in my car. Come on. Hello, textures, you here? Hey. Get rid of all the other units, that might help. Um, let's press two for that one, get that one out of here. Flatbed, assistance required on a uh, Elysium Field Freeway. All right, let's, um, can I, can I get the police computer to work? Okay, so the police computer's not working now. Texture pop is going all nuts. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Lovely. Right, let's get her done. So uh, she had um, destroying and concealing evidence as a, a warrant. So let's get her for that uh, warrant for arrest. Uh, traffic. Um, don't think she actually drove the wrong way. Okay. Um, we can still, like I say, you can add the um, charges at the end. Bending arrest, in the scene in an accident, reckless driving. Don't know if she went over 100, though. Because she, I know she hit 80 at once when I said it. But I didn't really notice if she went over 100. So we'll leave that on for now. Got all those. Didn't have no drugs on her. Didn't have any other possession or anything. Um, she never really had resisting because she never actually fled from the vehicle. Um, no homicide, no battery. Don't think any of those and none of those. Resisting arrest, no, that's fine. Cool. Smit those charges. Oops, stop the vehicle. You? Oh, there they go. There's my textures. I think it might be a vehicle that's causing that texture popping. Um, so I might need to try and figure out what that's all about. Um, but should be all good. Let's just open up the road here. Everything's all good. Tow trucks in route for that one. We'll just wait here a second. Oh, well, fine. That's the button I'm pressing. Uh, where is the closest jail? Not too far. Let's go. Let's go over there.
if we get too much texture popping, I'll probably just call transport. Which it might look like it we do because there's no street lights or anything. <laughs> yeah, okay. Alright guys, um let's as there's so much texture popping and so much issues at the moment, um what I'm gonna do is uh let me look. Have a look at her court case because I do really want to see what actually comes out with that. Uh, she got fined four thousand and two dollars. <laughs> Love how it's two dollars. Um, and four years in prison for all of that. So she got four years in prison for the warrant for arrest, and then evading arrest, leaving the scene of an accident, and reckless driving is all uh, fined. Uh, she got suspended license for seventeen months, and then she got granted probation for the other two. So. Good, good there. She's in prison for four years, so that's all good there. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, sorry about the texture, po uh, texture popping. I do apologise about that. I'm gonna try and fix that for the next episode. Uh, yeah, so sorry about that. And other than that, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on the next video.